from Colorado's high definition news leader. This is 9 News at 5. Well, sometimes the last thing you want to do when you're sick is get out of bed and drive to the doctor. Ask Cheryl. She was sick last week. We're so <laughs> glad she's feeling better and she's back here with us. Well, question for our viewers, though. Why should you have to travel to the doctor? Coming up, we'll take a look at home health care. Well, when you need to go see a doctor, you have a couple of options. You can either go to the hospital or a doctor's office, or they can come to you. Going to them takes not only more time, but it also can be more expensive. Nine Health reporter Dr. John Torres says that is the reason more and more people are choosing home health care as an option. When Connie Horak stops by Arlene's apartment in a Broomfield retirement community, the visits are about more than just health care. <laughs> there we go. Connie is a registered nurse and visits Arlene three or four times each week. You really develop a relationship with them. You get to know them and start to find out really what their needs are pretty closely. Why don't you take a couple of deep breaths and I'll listen to your lungs. Because she's here so often, Connie is able to spot potential health problems before they get so severe they require Require visits to the hospital. You start to get to know when she's looking great and, and when she's not having such a good week, and then we can really talk to her doctor, talk to her family, and make sure she gets the care she needs. And 90 year old Arlene loves that she's able to stay in the comfort of her own home instead of making regular visits to the doctor's office. I just feel it's a real privilege to have somebody coming in to my home. We talk about pain, if there's any discomfort with the wound or with swelling, make sure she's sleeping okay at night. This model of home health care could save a lot of money. Each visit by Connie is cheaper than a regular doctor's visit. And because emergency room visits are so expensive, avoiding a rush to the hospital can save thousands. It's a much cheaper version of health care. If we can save a hospitalization, that saves around $9,000 each hospitalization. Covenant Care at Home now has 11 nurses and is serving 85 clients in Colorado. Whatever a person may call their home, whether it's an apartment in the assisted living or an apartment at the village or a home, wherever they are, we can provide care. Have you noticed any new bruises anywhere? No. One look at the relationship between Connie and Arlene, and you can see, you see why the patients there? love it. I think she loves being here. <laughs> I think that, you know, I think patients like being in their home. It's where they're comfortable. Home health care visits like this usually require a prescription from a doctor. In addition to her regular health care visits from nurses, Arlene has also received at-home physical therapy, which she credits for getting her back on her feet after a surgery earlier this year. For Nine Health, I'm Dr. John Torres. And home health care visits are often covered by Medicare and private insurance companies as long as you do have that doctor's prescription. However, many rural areas of our state don't yet have access to this type of care. The Colorado Hospital Association says Medicare will start penalizing hospitals with high readmission rates next year. You just can't beat staying home. No. Well, it is true.